Spring is in the air. Everywhere you look around. Yeah. Okay. This is Marvin with uh, Preaching Sense. Yeah. I think I'm going to just stick to fragrances. Got a uh, springtime. I got five fragrances for you all. Um, get you all ready for the spring. I promise I, I won't sing anymore. Yes. So springtime, you all trying to, you know, get yourselves together. The weather is starting to get a little warmer and you need something to help you smell good. So I got five fragrances for you. First one on the list. This right here is by Parfum de Marley. This is Greenly. Parfum de Marley Greenly. This right here is all about the apple, the green apple. That's what it's going to open up with. Of course, it's going to open up with the ber bergamot. The orange is going to get you right for the spring. Um, this is a compliment getting fragrance. Look at that bottle. It is so beautiful. Um, this right here, you can wear this casually. You can wear it in the office. Uh, definitely compliment getting. Um, the price point, you know, you might pay up to, depending on how you can get on sale, it can run you from anywhere from $165 to maybe $200 worth every penny because it's such a beautiful fragrance. Uh, it has a little bit of a salty aquatic type of um, dry down, it has, the, of course, the, the woods and the musk down and the dry down as well, but it's all about the green apple. So this is Parfum de Mars Greenly. And I have another bonus. This is actually my bonus fragrance, and this is by Alexandria. This is Green Ivy. So if you feel like the Parfum de Marley Greenly is just too much money, you don't want to break off that much bread, uh, you can get this one for under 50 bucks. Um, they got them in 30 mil, 60 mil. I think they even got 15 mil. So you can you got a choice there. It smells just as good. And I will do a full review on Greenly versus Alexandria. Um, on the next another video, so stay tuned for that. The next one on the list is by Mansara, and I have a couple of these. Um, this one is by Mansara, it's Sicily, Sicily by Mansara. This right here is such a man. They just put about um, whew, it's such a nice fragrance. They put just about every fruit you can think of. Um, in this fragrance, um, got the orange, the grapefruit, you got the pineapple, the peach, um, the apple, the bergamot, they got rose, they got jasmine. It's a lot going on in here. Um, it leans a little feminine, but it is definitely guys, you can wear it too. Um, I say wear whatever you want, whatever makes you feel good. This right here is a friendly, playful type of, uh, fragrance. This is the one that you wear, you go into the park with your kids. Um, and you, you know, you just, you just in a playful, joyful mood. This is the kind of fragrance that you would wear. Um, and then you have, um, so that is Sicily, um, price point on this one, 65 to $90. It depends on if you're going to get a tester, you know, some people get the tester bottles and some will get the, um, actual one with the full package, full presentation. So it just depends on you tester ones. Uh, you know, sometimes they come with no cap. Sometimes they do have one or, you know, it just might look a little different. Um, but it just depends on you. So that's Sicily by Mansara. Now, if I were you, um, and you thought that one was too feminine, then you have Mansara. Sodrat Boise. This one right here is another beautiful signature scent type of um, fragrance right here. Opens up with the lemon, the bergamot, has the black currant, um, has a little bit of patchouli and some earthy notes in here. It has some woods and some vanilla type um, sandalwood in, in the base, which uh, really... Uh, this one can carry very well. It's really good in the spring, really good in the summer. Uh, this one is just a compliment getter as well. You can wear this one to the office, wear this to um, casual, wear it to the mall, wear it to uh, go in grocery shopping. And if you want, take these two and layer them. That's what I've done. Actually, I did that today. This is actually the scent of the day. Both of these. I layered it. 
Um, I started off with a little bit of Sicily, and then it was like, you know what? I wanted it was it was it's very fruity, so I put a little bit of mansara in there that gave it the woods, and it worked out very nice to me. Um, very good combination. Then after that, we have um, Banana Republic. This is Vintage Green number seventy eight. This right here, uh, I just enjoyed this so much last spring and summer, and can't wait to start wearing this again. This right here is just um, hmm, opens up with uh, the bergamot. Just it's uh, so good right here. Um, it has this a little bit of orange um, green leaves in there, and it has a fig note in there. I love fig. Fig is kind of a honey type of a note, if you're wondering. It has some woods and some uh, musk in there to give it a little bit of sweet, woody type of feel. You can overspray this. It's light. It doesn't last all day or anything like that, but it lasts long enough. And the hotter it gets, the more this thing goes to work. Compliments galore. My wife loves this one right here. It is very cool. And on a hot day or the hot spring days, this right here will make you feel refreshed. It makes you feel cool. It actually feels like it's cooling you down. It's uplifting. Wear it to the gym. Wear it to the store. Wear it in the office. That is Banana Republic's Vintage Green. Then, oh, and I forgot to tell you, this right here, you can get this for like 35 40 bucks. So it's a good price. It's a steal. Last but not least, this right here. It's a special fragrance right here, man. This is Homage à l'Homme uh, Eau de to uh, Toilette Lalique. Long name, but man, this thing is, uh, it's all about the violet in this, man. Violet. Right there, man. This violet is kind of a candy, woody type of note. has saffron in it, uh, which is kind of a honey, leathery type of note has bergamot, that's the lemon-lime type of note. This right here makes you feel happy. It makes you feel cozy. It uplifts you all at the same time. You want to wear this. Um, this is more something I would dress up with this right here. Look at the bottle, beautiful bottle. Uh, you can wear this on uh, date night. This is um, also one that my wife really loves. Um, it has a little bit of musk and uh, pepper in it to kind of give a little bit of heft to it. Uh, but the price point is kind of hard to find, actually. It's not everywhere, but the price is pretty good. And I got this one right here for about $35. Uh, I'll leave a link to some of these in the description so that you can find them. Uh, this right here, I think I bought this. It comes with like a, a body wash set, which I didn't care about, but for 35 bucks, I'm like, cool. Um, if not, I think I've seen it going up in the fifties and sixty dollar range. But look around for it. I'm gonna leave a link to see where you can find it. But that is uh, homage uh, a la homme, um, eau de toilette la lique, long name. So those are the five fragrances I have for you all. If you like this video, um, you know, subscribe. You know, like, um, leave some comments down below. Let me know if you all have any other things, uh, any other content you want me to put out, uh, any other fragrances you want me to review. And, and that's all I got for you all. So I look forward to seeing you in the next video. This is Marvin with Preaching Sense.